Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to spatchcock a chicken, otherwise known as butterfly chicken, and we're going to roast it up right here on the fire escape. We're starting here today with a good organic chicken. This one weighs about 4.3 pounds. And the first thing you want to do is turn it breast side down. Take a pair of kitchen scissors and remove the backbone. Just run your scissors down each side of the backbone. You could do this with a knife as well, but I find it's way, way easier to do with a pair of scissors. And you're going to have to crunch through some bone here. But the scissors really make it a lot easier than a knife. And there you go. The next thing we do is take a knife and make a slit in the breastbone up by the wings. And this will help open the bird up so it's nice and flat. Now we're going to add some olive oil. Get that all around. And now for our seasonings. We've got some good coarse salt. This is lemon pepper garlic powder, herbs de Provence. I'm a huge fan of herbs de Provence. It's about my favorite seasoning. And some fresh ground black pepper. Then flip the chicken over skin side up and do the same exact thing. Now I'm putting the chicken on a roasting rack. And as you can see, I tuck the tips of the wings underneath the bird. Out here I've preheated the Weber Q and we are going to roast our spatchcock chicken. Now, if your chicken weighs under three pounds, I'd say you could go directly on the grates, but since this chicken's a little over four pounds, I think roasting is the better way to go. And as you can see, I'm using a smoke pouch, and here about 30 minutes in, I'm gonna move that pouch to the other side of the chicken to make sure we get a nice, even flavor. And then close the lid and keep on grilling. And how about a customary beer check? Today I am drinking a Brooklyn Pilsner. This is a Pilsner with some serious flavor. Perfect for grilling. We are now at exactly the one hour mark. The temperature in the thighs looks like about high 170s. And in the breasts here, we're just about at 160, so it's time to come in. So that's how you grill a spatchcock chicken on your fire escape. This bird came out great, but it's a roast chicken and roast chicken always comes out great. Is there a reason to spatchcock it as opposed to just roasting it whole? And the answer is not really. It did save about 30 minutes worth of cooking time, but to be honest, it's really more about the presentation. It's about trying something new. And one more thing, it gives you a great picture to put on Instagram. And isn't that what life's all about these days is how many likes you get on Instagram? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, and of course, keep on grilling.